uh, this is the marketplace area, I think, yes. Walter's play. I don't have any time. All right. Another reduce. Hello. Now uh, what? Lots to do. Every piece of clothing in the whole region has gone through my nimble fingers at some point. Show me your clothing. Lots of boots. Lots of gloves. Lots of pants. Nothing special, except for these. These are women's clothes, which I'm not gonna wear. Robe of Confusion. The glitter and precious stones on the robe mimics the dancing of fireflies, making it difficult to strike the weaver. Okay, attack minus four for attacker, which is Awesome, by the way. It has armor value of chest 2, belly 3, back 3, left arm 2, right arm 2, left leg 2, right leg 2. That's a very good rope. And by the way, uh, magicians like my character, wh whatever character that uses magic, can't wear metallic armor like bronze or steel or whatever you can't wear them because it will prevent you from casting spells so you have to rely on robes or at best leather armor compared compared to mine this is way better but it's 500 ducats which is a lot i have three <laughs> hello Newspaper boy, Corbett. The Nadere Gazette, or an Adventurian Herald, only two farthings an issue. Really? I'd like the latest issue, issue of the Nadere Gazette. Here you go, a brand new issue of the Gazette, hot off the press. You actually get a newspaper and you read whatever. Leomar of the mountains on a secret mission. Home, one of the, one of our valued valued reporters met the well-known Leomar of the mountain unexpect, unexpectedly in the vicinity of Navadi country. Unfortunately, he was not willing to make any comments. The fact that he was traveling with a highly decorated warrior, however, suggests that. Something mysterious is going on there. Naturally, we will be we will break the news in an exclusive story as soon as we are able to learn anything new. Might it might it have something to do with the Tar Hanux advances advances? A confidential source spoke of a secret society for the protection of the Novari. Thus, there is definitely hope that Al Anfa and its leader, who has obviously been afflicted with madness, will be stopped. Okay, so you read news. It's a news paper. What did you expect? Inconspicuous man. It's the same dude that we saw at the harbor with. You. Ah, I missed it. Excuse me, uh, don't you have a farthing for a poor man? This is beggar grey hair, which the merchant told us to go see for information about the pirates. Perhaps, do you know anything about the pirates that have been preying on the ships on the Great River? Hey, hey, very well. There's already some talk going around about why no one has managed to get these fellows. People will say that the pirates can make their ships invisible by magic. Really? Hmm, an interesting story. That would explain why they managed this, how they managed to escape so quickly. Please, will you give me some arms? One hand washes the other. Sure, here's 
Here, take this party. Pray us protect you. Do you want me to tell you anything else? What can you tell me about the town? Oh, a lot. It depends on what you want to know. Perhaps you know where I can purchase something special? Let me think. Well, Crooked Auto behind the temple of Praos, he has very special things. Psst, come closer, bud. Yes? Well, if you stage one fight or the other in the arena under Nadalek, then the Medicus Model Mash has some exceptional items to sell. You didn't hear it from me. <laughs> Thanks for the tip, mate. Of course not. Please, will you give me some arms? One hand washes the other. Here you go. Protection. That's enough for you. Do you want me to tell you anything else? Nope. You're driving me broke. Uh, you. I'm sorry, not. No time to talk. Maybe another time. Okay. Let me... What are you doing here? Is this your brother? Step right up, sir, and fulfill a wish for only one farthing. One farthing for a wish? Yes, just throw a farthing in the well and make a wish. Your wish will be granted. Hmm. Okay, why not? Throw a farthing in the well, make a wish for a farthing. Well, it's worth a try. Your wish will soon come true, I'm sure of it. Good day to you. Thank you. I just lost a card. It better be worth it. Jura Kalim 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 board. Go ahead and poke through these pieces of jewelry from all corners of Aventuria. Show me what you have to offer. Actually, I came here to sell the. Oh, yeah, not you. Jewels of Raja, a golden amulet that magically en enhances the wearer's charisma. One point to charisma. This ring of Facts. A beautiful magic ring made of strange bluish metal that m miraculously increases the wearer's dexterity. Plus what to dex? Agility. I know what it does. I'm not gonna read it. I came here to sell the silver ring, which I found on the trash. Yeah. Twenty for the Bell L. Hey, give me the. The Nadere Gazette or an Adventurian Herald. I like the latest Only issue of the Adventurian Herald. I like the latest issue of the Adventurian Herald. Here you go, a brand new issue of the Herald, fresh off the press. I want to see if it, it's got different news. Herald. Oh, oh, that's a lot. Okay, Rondra. The found the Foundland store branded trading firm purchased it. I'm not gonna read. I'll read it another time. This is uh Alchemist Bench where I can craft alchemical potions and whatnot. I have to I need to have like points in alchemy which I don't have. I don't even have the I haven't learned the talent yet. And I have no recipes. Recipes. Your hero has arrived at a bench. At a lab bench. Your hero can make potions and tinctures. Okay. At workbench you can build bows and ammunition. At an anvil you can forge objects. In order to do this you must master the appropriate talent and have the required requested requisite ingredients and recipes the party must also have transferred the recipe or instructions into the recipe book you will find you will find benches in almost every district you can also have them installed on your boat but it is expensive i know that from my previous game alchemist aurelia what can Aurelia the Alchemist do for you? Is there something I can I could do for you? Do you see those scandalmongers over there by the temple? They've been getting on my nerves for days now. Could you please bring them this special beer to teach them a lesson? What's in the special beer? 
I'll see what I can do. Is there anything else I can do for you? Uh, can you teach me alchemy? Ten ducats. Nope. Oh, sorry. What do you have for staff? What can Aurelia the Al Alchemist Glove, which two points to alchemy. Alchemist Apron. Nice armor. No points in alchemy? Okay. Salts, potions, ingredients, recipes. These are the recipes I was talking about. Okay, that's me. Yes, he wanted to show a customer how to put on a suit of armor properly. So, uh, so to do that, he put it on himself. That was doomed to fail. Hello, guys. Aurelia, or maybe me, want to give you those two drinks. Don't yak at me, turnip nose. What did you call me? Hey, leave my maid alone. Hmm. I wanted to invite you to enjoy a tankard of beer with me. I can't say no to that. Hey, give me some too. Of course, there's enough for both of you here. Be my guest. By the way, Aurelia says hi. Rabbit. 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 That was evil, by the way. Wasted Aurelia. Oh shit, they turned back. What can Aurelia the Alchemist do for you? I gave those candle mongers some of your beer. That'll teach them a lesson. Thank you very much. Here's a small reward for your trouble. Is there anything else I can do for you? Uh, no thanks. I'm good. Okay. So. We were told... Wait for it. Uh, Greyhaired the beggar. We talked to him. Bailiff Rag Rabig at the south gate. Okay, I'm gonna gather all the information I can. South gate. Let me check this area. What is this gate for you? No, just a town guard. The map is like north, south, west, east. So just by heading south, we'll get to the gate eventually, I hope, I think, barrel, two barrels, kill the barrel. Nice. Put away your weapon or don't. Two more barrels to kill. Get out of the road, chicken. This is the tough bit. Oh, I think this is, yes, down guard product. This is a smith. This is an anvil. No recipes, of course. Like Here you are. Arno. What, you're waiting for me? I'm interested in your rare. I'm not, but I'm gonna say that anyway. Okay. Uh, nothing of interest to me. Too many recipes. I can learn. Here you are. I can have any character learn the spell, but the problem is you have to spend points on it, so I have to know, I have to, like when you get a spell, you click the upgrade and you spend points on the talent you want to upgrade. 
I'm not gonna have like my main character specialize in everything. I want him to be mainly an alchemist. I'll have other characters like the dwarf Fargrim who we met earlier. He will eventually join me. I'll make him the blacksmith. Another character will make along the way. I'll make her a boyer. She's an archer. Which is suitable for this talents and background. Hello. Greetings. Can I help you? Yes. Perhaps. As a member of the town guard, I'm sure you are aware of what has been going on around here. Have you heard anything about the recent fire raids? Yes. As a bailiff, I hear quite a lot about what's going on. However, I don't have much to say about the pirate attacks. It's rumored that their ringleader has lizard blood in his veins. Really? Hmm, interesting. Thank you for your help. You don't really want to pick a fight with them, do you? If there really are any lizard monsters behind it, I would be very cautious if I were you. I'll be careful. Thank you again. Greetings. Can I help Is you? Is there anything I can do for you? I'm going to die of thirst in the guardroom. Bring me a Furdock Pale Ale, please. That would be worth a few farthings of my pay. Uh, you're not in a guardroom. You're standing at the gate. But okay. Oh, I have filled the. I have a full tanker of for the fair air, pale air, or right, right here, which I collected from a trash barrel behind the end. Ah, bless you! Here are the coins I promised you. Thank you. One dollar. Now that we we can fast travel, but that will. Report. Okay, let's just go back to the marketplace. Hmm, let me try the other route just to change the scene. By the way, do you have any barrels that needs to be killed behind your mythic? You do. Let me check the corner. Nothing. You need to die. Okay. So light brown crates need to die. Brown crates we just open. That's because that crate was shabby and you know it served its use. It has to die now. Nothing here. Still building up there? I see you right here hiding. Bobby Barrel, die. I'm cleaning the streets of all the Bobby. Hello? Well, there's the Baron still crawling the streets. Make sure you don't fall, alright? This is the temple. <sighs> Behind the temple, he told me about a uh, certain merchant who can sell <coughs> interesting, so to say, merchandise. Let's go take a look about at what he has. Good stuff. I'll be back for you. Oh. Apparently, caged animals is part of what he has to say. I missed what he crap. A giant snail. Blah. They're called mofos, I think. I forgot. Spiders. 
if you admire. Well, are you looking for that certain something? Then you're at the right place here. Show me what you have. Okay, not what I was looking for. Frog legs, Meyer beast teeth, giant crab pincers, silk glands which he collects from spiders, scorpion stingers, spider fangs, okay, wild boar skin, okay. I can collect all of these items on my by killing animals and harvesting them. Because I forgot about you, huh? This will take me to the underground. We'll come back to this area soon. As the beggar told us, there are fight there, we can bet on them. We even can join by the way, which we will definitely do. Argo, what we found out already. Now we're at the end. I see you two barrels hiding up there. This is Arlo, but we will talk to him next time. So see you guys next time and hope you enjoyed.